First of all, we don't make it. Second of all, credit to Golden Boy because they did their job with Jaime Mugia. They did exactly what they, they wanted to do with him. They, they built him up. They got him all these fights. You know, even when people wanted to see Mugia, you know, put against tougher competition, the ultimate goal was the Canelo fight, and now it's there. Mexicans uh, wanted this fight on Cinco de Mayo. It makes sense for everybody. It goes back to that person giving you a bunch of chains. What do you think Munguia needs to do to win? You know, obviously to pick him up. Hey, Munguia just needs to continue doing what he's doing. He's going to be able to take the punches of Canelo. He takes a big shot. He's going to be a lot bigger. If there's no hydration clause, he's going to probably outweigh Canelo by 20 plus pounds. That size is going to matter. Canelo hasn't been able to knock out opponents like he's been doing. And I don't know if it's because of the power or the fluctuating in weight or the years. Either way, Mungia's youth and his resilience is going to be enough to make it a fight. Man, that's a great question. That's a great, I, I sure hope so, man, because we, we want that fight with Devin Haney. Uh, it, I, I don't like what I'm seeing with Ryan Garcia. I don't think none of us do. I mean, it's, it's concerning. But, uh, you know, you live by social media, you die by social media. And right now he's being held... You know, for all the all the things he's saying, and it just doesn't sound right. I just hope he pulls it off. If he does make if he does make it to obviously for twenty, you know, the, the Devin Haney could be Rich for getting the excellent. How would you break down this fight if he does make it? Look, man. I, I, regardless, even Ryan Garcia had the perfect camp, and he wasn't showing these signs of, of his issues and personal issues outside the ring. I still will favor Devin Haney. I favor Devin Haney over over anybody. I mean, I just think he's that special. I think I think Tank's probably the only one I wouldn't favor him over, but it'll still be a competitive fight. Either way, I think Devin Haney's a beast. At 135, 140, he's a man. If you're Zipper's management, who do you put him next, and who do you avoid? I would I would manage him to to keep doing main events like this. Do it all over Las Vegas. Do it in in, in Southern California. Do it in Texas. Keep doing this. I mean, he's becoming a star. Uh, you don't need to rush him right into the, the hard shots. I think a, a, a fight with like Edwin DeSantos makes all the sense in the world. If he can knock out DeSantos, do something that Shakur couldn't do, that's how you turn heads. That's how you get the attention of Shakur. And of course, Shakur Stevenson is a master boxer. With the style of Zepeda, how do you give him the best chance to, to, to win that fight? Who, Zepeda? Yeah. Uh, break him down, punch him between the shots. Uh, of course, that, that pressure, body shots. Forget the head. Don't, you're not even going to land any head shots on on Shakur Stevenson. No one does. No one does. So just aim at the body, try to chop him down, and cross your fingers that you're able to land one in one of those ribs and, and hurt someone like that. And the is not a big trash talker. Does he have to become a trash talker? No, 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 no. Mexican fighters, they're not trash talkers. Chavez, you know, Salvador Sanchez, these are the humble warriors that do all the talking in the ring. What's your thoughts on uh, Mike the Mike Tyson? Tyson? Oh, perfect. Yeah. Mike Tyson, 58. What, 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 is that good for boxing? Uh, fight, you know, fighting a, a Jake Paul who's obviously in mid, I think, late 20s. Look, man, I, I've always been uh, a, a, a critic of, of Jake Paul and, you know, having him fight real fighters and boxers. Um, but fighting a fighter that hasn't fought in over 20 years of Mike Tyson, he got beat, you know, 20 years ago. And, the last, but, last two fights got knocked out. Yeah, he got locked, knocked out the last two fights. So... At 57, 58 years old, that's come on, man. You're you're, you're fighting a senior citizen, you know, and, and it's not fair. I mean, he can look for he can look like a beast, Mike Tyson, for like the the, the 10 second clips that he posts on social media. Anyone could do. I could look like a killer right now on the pads for 10 seconds, but as soon as you turn that camera off, I'm gonna be huffing and puffing and sore. Mike Tyson's not gonna, it's not gonna be a good look for his legacy. He's gonna raise a lot of money, and people are gonna watch. But I don't like the fight. Are you tuning in? Absolutely. <laughs> you, think, you think Mike Tyson gets knocked out? If there's no headgear? If there's no headgear, I think he, I think Mike gets uh, I think Mike gets speed up where they probably stop the fight. I hate to say that. I hate to say if that. If he does not come out, would Sergio come back and fake Jake Paul? I oh, mean, I'll fake Jake Paul for free. Jake Paul, I'll fight you for free anytime. <laughs> I'm weighing 190 now, so let me know. Make it work. Awesome, <laughs> appreciate it.